What's up and welcome back. Nick up here at Maple Motors in Hendersonville, Tennessee. And today's test drive is this 1934 Chevy sedan. It's a beautiful ride, custom interior, custom paint aftermarket wheels, dual exhaust out the back. Detail pictures, financing, and shipping are available at maplemotors.com. This one here has got the 57350. Looks like AC. Uh, well, we got power steering down there. We do. It's down in there. Electric fan, power brakes. It's nice and clean inside here, too. Okay, guys, I'm going to go ahead and get things buttoned up here. We're going to be picking out the flaws throughout this video because uh, you can see all the good, but I want you to know the bad before you get here. It's about that time. Let's go for a ride. Okay, let's look around the interior, check everything out. Place those bets. Do you think the horn works? We'll be trying it out here in just a moment. Look at the odometer. Show you the mileage. It's hard to stand my mileage in a 34 model, but hey, that's what it says. It's all custom in here. It looks beautiful. I love all the little details put into this car here. There's my bag. It's all the gear that I use to make this video. You can see that below in the description with Amazon links. Easy to pick up. It's funny, in the walk around video, I didn't look up here. I guess that's your backup camera. It's literally right there. <laughs> I don't know how I missed that. Let's go ahead and start this thing up. The clock's working. We don't have to get gas. We got good old pressure. Blower motor. Blowing pretty good. CB down here. Let's see. Wow, they got the wipers working through here. That's great. Still column. A couple cigarette lighters there. Did you place your bets on the horn? Let's try it out. It does work. Check this out though. <laughs> Two horns. <laughs> Radio. Where's on? FM. Something. Just looking for some sound here. Good deal. It is working. Windows. Sweet. This window here. A little slow as well. And see if this cuts on. There's a switch under here too. I don't know if it's got a cut on from another switch or what's going on, but I think that was your backup camera there and there was a switch under here that I was using, which we'll keep our eye on the water temperature because that could be just for the electric fan. So, let's go ahead and take off and see what else we can find. Okay, this is the first time I've driven this ride personally. Reverse right there. Drive right there. Go ahead and get out of here. Brakes are touchy on this one. They stop fast. Turn signals popping up on both sides of the dash there. All right, here we go. Woo. Touchy throttle. This thing's straight as an arrow going down the road. I'm going to touch the brakes now. They stop fast. Back in the throttle. What happens when I floor? Down. It feels good. Again, when you first 
hit the brakes, they're really touchy. And they got a little bit of a left pull when you first touch them too, look. It's not bad. Tight steering. Speedometer's working. Looks to be correct on this one. That's kind of cool. You can touch the the washer switch on there and it'll move it just a little bit at a time. That way if you need to adjust it back up. Because this one you gotta play that game where you cut it off right in time. Engine temperature sitting right at 175. Oil pressure's at 30. That gas pedal is touchy on this one. Just a little stiff more than anything. Which causes me to push a little bit harder and then it just goes. Yeah. to get used to it. I'm going to try to get some undercarriage shots. I know this thing's low to the ground, uh, but I also don't want to destroy the camera by running over it. <laughs> but we'll get some outside footage, and then we'll end with picking out the flaws where I walk around the whole car looking for chips and scratches. All right, guys. Thanks for sticking around. I'll be back here in a minute. Well, it took me a second. You see how low that is? We're gonna go in this little pothole here. I got this idea from y'all. If y'all have suggestions on how to make these videos better, give them to me and I'll try them out. I mean, let's we'll see what's happening. Hopefully this works.
let's roll got all my gear I tried to make it a little interesting there by finding a hole in the ground it was not a very deep hole but it did work there's a giant one back there but somebody's liable to run over everything pulling in here I'm starting to get used to the throttle What's cool is you can see the red light or the green light right now inside this. That's awesome. That's what that's made for too. Because right now you can't see it. Hopefully it's popping up on there where you can see it. It's because the roof is so low in the front. All right, let's roll. Watching out for the bicycle guy. So far it runs, it drives great. That electric fan's been cutting on like it's supposed to. car is decently smooth going down the road too pretty quiet not a lot of wind noise everything seems tight bump up here in the road will hit give her a listen not bad at all like I said everything's pretty tight on this one uh, test drive has went very well picking out the flaws is coming up next look below in the description check out some of the stuff that I use to make these videos there's more useful information below I'm pulling back in the lot thanks for watching go let's walk around this ride anything I find uh, you'll know about it there's detailed pictures at maplemotors.com finance and shipping is available on all of our rides man this is crazy looking I love the color beautiful car inside and out I love the motor that's in it now we're gonna be looking for chips scratches rust and dents let's go around the front end you do got some light little scratches some little chips from the road.
little scuffs here on the edge. Got some little paint bubbles popping up there. A little hole there. A little scratch. chips here around the back side crack there up here as well chip there chip here right there in the corner touch up more Scuff there. Scratches in the paint there. The edge. Little chip there on the edge. Also on the roof. top here so right there you got a little bubble popping up on top of the roof you can kind of see it needs to be cleaned up a little bit coming back through midsection got some scratches up here in the middle Backside, some cracks in the paint. Back here too. It looks like it's got a backup camera. I haven't seen a screen in there. Not yet, at least. Look around. A light molded inside. Looks pretty good. Nice and clean. Okay, coming down this side. A little bubble there in the back. Little spot there. are in good shape on this one. So somebody's been stepping on this. I usually just try to avoid stepping on it because it leaves scratches. You can see the scratches that are on it. Spot there. Crack up here. Woo. Look at that safe. That was crazy. I don't know how I'm going to get it back open now. It's hung on something. Hang on just a second, guys. Okay, so yeah. It's got like a little bend deal. It's not exactly correct. Wind catches that. I'm glad I was standing here. Nothing happened. Woo. A little spot there. Spot there as well. bubble at the bottom of the door the paint there looks like signs of older glass the door's kind of hanging a little bit on the bottom 
chips here on the edge. Chip there. Up here in the corner. We got some little chips on top here. Front. Chip here. On the roof there. Right there in the front. Scratch right there in the middle. All right, I've walked around the ride. Let's go ahead and open her up. Look at the interior. Motor started. Door panel on this one looks awesome. They redid it. Chips in your jam. The seat on this one looks good. Pretty clean. I love the interior. Looks awesome. Somebody spent a lot of money getting this done. Well, I have the keys in my pocket. Starts right up. See, it's still cold. I haven't done the test drive yet. This is a before the test drive. Clock's working. Emergency <laughs> brake down there. Feels like it's engaging too. I don't know. It's got a backup camera on the back. But I haven't seen a screen in here for it, so I don't know what that was about. I don't know. It was there though. Butter the hood super clean too. There. Look here. There it is. Chip on the corner. Guys, I appreciate you watching. If you're new to the channel, hit subscribe and share this video. Detailed pictures, finance, and shipping are at maplemotors.com. And of course, I got more test drives to do today, so I'm going to get over there, get some done. Let me know what you think about this ride in the comments. I didn't show this. I don't know why or how I missed it, but I did. Show it now. This 
scuffed up and not bad. They must have backed right into something. How sad. Okay, guys. See you in the next video. Later.